Hey guys, what up? Another not so pointless video that you have to listen to. Because I'm goofy. And what am I doing right now? I don't know. Okay, two points in the video that I want to point out. Prime being drug free and people not having the right birth certificate. As in either having a copy or something that's not even a birth certificate. So the drug free. If you come into Prime to work, make sure you're drug free. Make sure you have two months peeing, pooping, getting all that damn marijuana, all the whatever drugs, I don't care what you take, out your system. I don't give a shit what you do. Don't come to Prime for orientation with drugs in the system. They're going to send you home and you got to pay for it yourself. Then I'm the one laughing at you. Just saying. Now, the other thing is, was the birth certificate. While I had orientation, I had at least three or four people that didn't have the right birth certificate. They either had copies, or they had, what was it? There was something else that wasn't a birth certificate that they thought it was. And if you can, if you don't have the right birth certificate, you either have to call your, was it your local county office, whatever, email them, no, go to the site, wherever you were from, and have them see if they can send you one, or get a family member to get it for you and send you it, same day ship it. It's gonna cost you money, oh well. You wanna get the job, you don't wanna pay to get home, pay it for them to ship it. And if you don't have that, if I'm correct, you could also bring a passport. Passports as well. Make sure. Yeah, passports. I'm not sure about the passports. Oh, I know. I'm correct. You have your passport. You get to, if you want to join Prime, you get an email from your. Fuck. What's that called? Oh, your recruiter. Your recruiter sent you your um, email, letting you know what you could bring. I think it's either a passport or your birth certificate, just to verify who you are, so that when you go to the DMV, you can get your your, your permit. And then your license too. You use both of them both times. Wow, I'm stuttering. Okay, back to being drug free when you before you come to Prime. It was actually a couple guys. I can give a little, quick little story, like two second story. Guy joined the same time I did orientation. He says, "Oh man, I, I hope they don't what's it called a drug test." I'm like, of course they're going drug test. I told you going drug test. Why are you coming here not thinking they're going drug test? He's like, "Oh okay. Well, I haven't smoked in a month. I should be good, right?" Uh, do you smoke every day? He's like, yeah. I'm like, you're not going to be good. Guess what? He wasn't good. They sent him home. Well, they told him he can't do it because he has drugs in his system. In his blood or pee. It was in his urine. They do a urine test, by the way. Now, a lot of people tell you that. It's a urine test. They do it the same day of orientation. And most of the time, they will catch it. So if I was you, flush out your system. Quick. Don't do drugs. Don't smoke your marijuana, your, your devil's lettuce. <laughs> devil's lettuce. Before orientation, guys. Yeah, some people tell you, oh yeah, I got away with it. I know how to flush my system. I'm good, I'm good. And if they get away with it, they get away with it. That's none of my business. Yeah, the whole point of this video, this two second video, let you guys know, be drug free when you come to Prime and make sure you have the fucking proper passport or proper birth certificate. So, yeah, I'm truck. Well, I'm not truck it. This is truck it, and I'm Gabe. You guys have a good night.